Shalom, shalom. Just real quick, but uh, before I begin, want to give all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh Bashim Yahshua Bashim Akarikadash, the bonds of the apostles, the bonds of the elders, the great millstone, rule well and tells the truth. Much respect to you, brothers out there, just preach this word in truth and sincerity throughout the four corners of earth. Tabernacle David, hope for like and speckle burn the one say shalom. Like I said, just real quick, I just want to get a and get into a couple news news articles I seen earlier today and uh, yesterday, you know, a bunch of madness and prophecies going on. You know, it's it's beautiful. Some beautiful times they be living in. Uh, before I begin, I'm gonna get uh, Isaiah 62 and verse six. I've set watchmen upon thy walls of Jerusalem, which shall never hold their peace day nor night. So videos is coming out day daily, man. From the brothers around the world, mainly the brothers of GMS and those that are preaching the same likewise doctrine. Those that are in order, blowing the trumpet, washing the blood off their hands. All right. Ye that make mention of the Lord Yahweh by Shemiel Shai, keep thy silence and give him no rest until he establish, until he make Jerusalem a praise in the earth. You see, and that's what we're doing. You know, this is part of making our calling election sure. We're blowing that trumpet. We're warning you of the times that we're living in. And we're giving the Lord no rest. Because we're trying to get the heck up out of here. There's so much wickedness that's uh, pursuing out of this kingdom, man. It's got to be taken off the face of the earth. Well, it's going to be blown up. <laughs> All right. And Lord willing, we those men, we get beaten up. As you see right here, North Korea warns U.S. may have given it a green light for nuclear attack. And if I'm not mistaken, I read, uh, where was it? Maybe in here, North Korea fires missiles as U.S. nuclear submarine docks in South Korea. Yeah, the, uh, the hammer of the earth is about to be brought down, man. About to be brought down. Yeah, Miami woman, 18, 18 years old, man, allegedly tried to hire a hitman to kill her son, three-year-old son. It is you, you, you saving up money to hire a hitman, and it looks like she got beat the hell up. You see, that don't make the mothers, mothers like they used to. See, back then, we didn't have all the amenities that we have now, the air conditioning, you know, the water and all that stuff, man. We was out there working, and Jake was having children upon children in those days, man. And they stood, stood together to care of their children. Our family was strong. But now these, these women are so out of order, man. Drunk off the wine of Babylon. that They don't want to take care of their responsibility. That's your child, man. You saving up money just to take your child off, off the earth, man. Once again, it looked like somebody beat the hell up out of her, man. <laughs> and that's just a prelude to uh, what's going to happen. Matter of fact. Before I get into North Korea, uh, I'm going to get the scripture on her. Slocky, um, his limitations. His limitations. Four and verse three, even the sea monsters draw out the breast and they give suck to the young ones. Thy daughters of my people is become cruel like the ostrich in the wilderness. You see that? They, hey, these women, they out of order. You got animals. They they take care of they, they children better than you. <laughs> We're supposed to be the superior species. And, and you over here. <laughs> man, this it's madness, man. Man. Let me see if I want to get any more on this. Yeah, I'm gonna go to. Um, I don't know if y'all was keeping up with the Car Carly. What's her name? Carly Russell situation. You know the madness, the wickedness of a woman, man. <laughs> She's over there. So apparently, in in that story, man, she had finessed the whole world, <laughs> thinking that she was out there missing. Apparently, she stole some money. Allegedly, this, this is what I heard. Allegedly, she stole some money. And, um, you know, that's why she came back home with like $107 in a, in a, a sock. 
and pretty much, you know, uh, uh, the FBI or whoever was looking at her phone and she had some searches, you know, Amber Alert, the movie Taken, you know, all that stuff. So pretty much she planned this out. You know, it's the wickedness of a woman. <laughs> she planned this out and pretty much she was getting back at her uh, ex because her, apparently her ex um, was sleeping with a with a uh, stripper, and so she was pretty much man. I'm I'm gonna go out here and have these people <laughs> worried about me. That's that's pretty much what I the gist of what I got from it, from it. So like, let me uh, look up the scripture. Leave this wickedness of a woman. Let me look that up real quick. This is um, Sirach 25 and verse 19. All wickedness is but a little wickedness of a woman. Let a portion of a sinner fall upon her. So these women are just out of order, man. That's why we need the kingdom. They out here making fake Amber Alert calls. They out here trying to... Uh, they're either killing their children, killing, killing themselves, man. It's just so much... Wickedness proceeding out of this kingdom, man. It's, hey, why, it's why we need order. Our women back in the day, they, they had more order. They had more backbone. <laughs> and then they weren't a fool off of these uh, GMO fools either. <laughs> Cracked out. And drunk off the wine of Babylon. Let's see, you have... Um, mm, let's see... MOTB that will end gun ownership in America. Yeah, they're trying to track everything. They want you to be uh, uh, good old citizens, man. Don't question anything. Don't fight back. But as we know in the scriptures, the people are going to fight back. But eventually, a lot of these people are going to take the MOTB. Let's see, as you see right here, the stuff that we've been telling you about was in the juice, transgender, transformer, says hormones can help kids <laughs> going through the wrong pu puberty, man. Hey, we, we got to get the heck up out of here, cuz. <laughs> we got to get the heck up out of here. Let me see if I get that scripture. This is uh, Job 13 of verse 4. But ye are forgers of lies. You are all physicians of no value. Because I also saw an article the other day. A lot of these people have been misdiagnosed. But that's by, that's by design as well. Because they want to get rid of a lot of people. And, you, and you're a physician of no value regardless, man. If you follow after the ways of the Bible. Actually had true med medicine out here. This world would be a, a way better place, man. But they don't want that. They want a, uh, a kingdom, a population in which they can control. They want to be like the Most High. As we read right here, Sirach 38 and verse 4. The Lord, Yahweh Bashem al created medicines out of the earth. He that is wise will not hoard them. See that? Lord has true medicine and that's that's why a lot of these people are out here pass, passing out, man. And a whole bunch of athletes die from cardiac arrest. And, and this, this is all because of this kingdom, man. GMO foods, the juice. And now they want uh, uh, these little booty warriors walking around here. It's madness, man. Going back to um, Mr. Swab here. <laughs> All right, this is uh, Isaiah 10 and verse 1. Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decree and our rights grievousness, which they have prescribed. The Lord said, woe, destruction unto these people. All right, because they're trying to control the whole world. They're trying to be like the Most High. And guess what? The Most High, Yahweh Bashem El Shai, is going to fool their plans. Fool, fool their plans, man. Let's get this right here. Let's see the United States nuclear submarine appearance in South uh, Korea 
is grounds for North Korea to consider nuclear recom repercussions, according to Defense Minister Kang Sun Nam. <laughs> All right. So I guess pretty much since that uh, nuclear miss uh, slack here, that nuclear submarine was pretty much around them or in their waters or whatever. They're like, hey, man, let's go. <laughs> you about to see the hammer of the earth. The hammer of the earth is uh, Babylon the Great. It's going to be broken down, man. It's going to be destroyed. Uh, for the sake of time, like I said, I, I wanted this to be a quick one. I'm going to go ahead and get uh, Jeremiah 51. We'll go ahead and close out on that. Give me one second while I turn to that. Uh, Jeremiah 51. This is Jeremiah 51. It's like, actually, I want to get Jeremiah 50. I want to get Jeremiah 50. Jeremiah 50 and verse 23. How is the hammer of the whole earth cut asunder and is broken? How has Babylon become a desolate desolation among the nations? How? Why? Because you, when you read this chapter, you have done wickedness upon his people. And the Lord has the Lord is going to take vengeance upon you, wicked ass niggas, man. The Lord is going to use these other nations to take you out. And those that remain and survive are going to be thrown into slavery. I have laid a snare for thee, and thou art also taken, O Babylon, that thou was not aware thou art found and also caught because thou hast strived against the Lord Yahweh by Samuel Shah. You see? You touched the apple of the Lord's eye. You're proud, you're pompous. Uh, I just did a lesson on it, um, earlier today about these uh, this Christian church, you know, saying that you can be a Christian and a fruity pebble at the same time, man. It's madness. So yeah, you 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 have to pay for that, man. As we read in verse 25, the Lord Yahweh Shemuel Shai has opened his armory and brought forth the weapons of, of his inner nation. For this is the work of the Lord Yahweh Shemuel Shai, power of hosts in the land of Chaldeans. All right, so you about to see the Lord's armory. What's the Lord's armory, man? It's these nuclear missiles. Also his, also his angels, also going to send out the men of the Lord, going to send out his son. <laughs> you fighting the losing battle. Let's see, I'm going to get verse 29. Call together the archers against Babylon, the archers, the men of war, the nuclear missiles. All ye bend the bow, camp against, against it round about. Let none therefore escape. None is going to escape. Like I said, uh, the ones that do escape, which is going to be the top banking family, the rich families, they're going to be thrown into slavery. But pretty much everybody over here that's not of the elect is going to be destroyed. Recompense her according to her work, according to all that she have done. Do unto her, for she is proud against the Lord Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh against the holy ones of Israel. Therefore shall her young men fall in the streets. All her men of war shall be cut off in that day, save the Lord Yahweh Shemel Shai. So yeah, you're going to be confounded. And as we see all these other nations are gearing up for war against you. They're not scared no more. The hammer of the earth is going to be brought down. So call the Lord Yahweh Shemel Shai, by Shem Karkadai, the of the apostles, the of the elders, the great millstone, Ruel, and touch the truth, and the wall of Baba Shalom.